China and Iran agreed to a $400 billion deal on April 3, which calls for substantial Chinese investments in Iran over a 25-year period in exchange for oil delivery. The agreement comes as the United States has been trying to stop Iran from exporting oil through severe unilateral economic sanctions and offensive activities against Iranian merchant shipping. It follows a previous Sino-Iranian military and economic cooperation struck in July 2020. A significant arms transfer to Iran has long been anticipated to occur once the UN's arms embargo on the country expires in October 2020. While Iran's defense industry has managed to become mostly self-sufficient and has been able to purchase much of what it does not produce from North Korea, which disregarded the arms embargo, this country's inability to acquire modern fighter aircraft has been a noticeable weakness. A small number of early fourth-generation fighters, including two MiG-29A and one Su-24 squadron from the Soviet Union as well as two locally upgraded American F-14A fighters, are in service. But the majority of the country's aircraft are outdated third-generation models that it purchased from the United States in the 1970s. China's lightweight 4-plus-plus generation J-10 degrees Celsius fighter has been recognized as a top contender to modernize the Iranian Air Force due to its needs for a more competent combat fleet.